Hello guys. Today in this video, we are talking about the movie Choked streaming on Netflix directed by Anurag Kashyap. But before starting the video, please like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Choked is the movie about the low middle class family living in the fastest city of Mumbai. As the title suggests, Choked represents the obstruction of the characters, their daily livelihood, and the society they live in. The movie has blended its storyline with the backdrop of the demonetization of all 500 rupees and 1000 rupee notes that happened in India in 2016. The connection between the characters and the demonetization is established nicely but their representation goes a little bit off at the end. Anurag Kashyap always comes up with the bold and fierce stories in his movies. But is choked as bold and as fierce than his previous ventures. I mean except ghost stories. So, let's find it out. The Storyline I appreciate the stories and plots of Anurag's movies. They are not like ones that are prevalent in mainstream Bollywood movies. Choked also carries an interesting storyline. The story showcases the humdrum lives of millions of middle-class Indian women through Sarita Pillai, one of the main characters of the movie. The daily routine of an early wake-up, cook, eat, work, sleep, and repeat nature of the woman who desires more luxury life than this is shown very convincingly. The story starts when a man stashes a big amount of money in his bathroom drain pipe. From there we can guess that the story is somehow related to the money. After all, money lures everyone. Then, the very normal and limited life of Sarita Pillai and her husband Sushant takes the story forward. Sarita is the doting wife who has the job at government bank as the bank cashier whereas her husband is a musician and jobless with a debt on his head. The bad drainage system of the house is the main part of the story. The story becomes more intriguing when Sarita unexpectedly finds out the bundle of cash notes using through her kitchen drain pipe. This is the moment where her happiness is shown her face as she is not so happy with her life throughout the story. The nosy and noisy neighbors help to show the nature of human beings and greed toward money. Choked is about what she does with that secret hoard, and through that adventure, it tells the story of a life stuck in a rut, a relationship at the edge of an abyss, greed, and corruption in the era of demonetization. During the first few plots of the story, the movie is intriguing as the director portrays Sarita's boredom and sense of hopelessness in her role as a wife and a home manager is very striking. The cast The casts are the ornaments of any story. They have the power to attract the audience and leave long-lasting impressions. The artists of Choked are brilliantly cast. Syami Khair, Roshan Matthew, and Amritar Subhash are the main leads. Syami Khair who plays the character of Sarita Pillai is praiseworthy. With the debut from the movie Mirzia, Syami still has not got the roles that she deserved. But the performance by her as the middle-class working wife says it all that she is capable of doing all types of roles. She has perfectly shown the shattered dreams and thwarted ambitions through her character. Though I have not seen any of Roshan Matthew's work, I could tell that he is flawless in the movie. He is the jobless man with the piled up debts in the movie which can't get more real than this. Siami and Roshan deliver their struggling marriage life in a good manner. We all know the gully boy fame actor Amrita Shuhash. She is a nosy and loud neighbor in the movie. She has played as that member of the colony who keeps it vibrant and funny. The Cinematography and the Music The cinematography in the movie is good. The scenes from the train stations and the neighborhood give the sense of the story and capture the daily struggle of a middle-class family. Besides this, the cinematography has nothing to do much in the movie. The music in the movie gets too loud in some scenes and does not carry the emotions of the story. But I really like the beatboxing and Indian touch to the background score. Taking demonetization as part of the story, the film becomes as disconnected and ineffective towards the end. Though it is being pitched as a satire on it, for me, the film stands well on its own. The whole film resides perfectly in two recurring shots, a drain pipe that flows money bundles and Sarita counting those notes and that is shown eloquently. The tagline of the movie choked is money speaks but what does money speak is not justified by the director. Choked wants to say a lot but it gets choked itself at the end. You can catch this movie on Netflix. So, that was the video guys. 
If you like the video then let me know in the comment section and please subscribe to our channel for more videos.